Hello, it's time for another plan as I go, and it's going to be for May 20th through the 26th. And I'm using my Vertical uh, Happy Planner Classic, and this kit from The Pink Room Co. And it's a mystery kit that I got in April, I believe. Yeah, and it actually came with two. Well, the mystery kit came with the April monthly and then two weekly kits, and it's so pretty. It's the same theme, it's macaron, macaron themed sure however you want to call it and anyway so uh, I'm waiting out the dates because you know I want to use the date cover and I don't know if you noticed when I was pointing at it but the date covers are all in one strip well two strips actually so the first thing I did was whited out the dates I think I said that already then I'm sticking down the Monday through Wednesday and cutting off the Wednesday then sticking down the Wednesday and then placing down the other one and cutting off the Sunday and placing it in the beginning of the page because if you didn't know I plan Sunday through Saturday so yeah and then I don't know if you can tell but uh, the spacing's kind of wrong so that's why there's a little gap between Sunday and Monday but oh well so then I uh, whited out the bottom pattern because it would show up and I wanted to use this washi tape from Recollections, and I did it to the other side also. <laughs> Please excuse my voice, it is allergy season and it's really bad today. And I just woke up so it's not so great. <laughs> I didn't just wake up, but you know what I mean. So I'm trying to do the sidebar, but then I realized this kit is kind of a mini kit. Or, you know, it's not, not as full kitty <laughs> oh gosh <laughs> as uh, a lot of other ones and it doesn't come with a lot of the stuff I normally use for um, the sidebar and I didn't want to bring out things from my collection because it wouldn't go with the kit and this kit is really pretty and I just wanted everything to match so anyway so in the sidebar at first I was going to put down a decoration sticker and then I was like no no, it doesn't fit, so I just stuck it down on between the Sunday and the Monday, that gap. Then for the notes section, I wrote uh, um, the mail I was waiting on. It's going to be added onto later on because, uh, yeah, I kind of went insane. So, uh, on, and then for the goals section, I wrote things I had to do for the week or wanted to do for the week. So after that, I started to plan after I put down the to-do headers to do yes because it only came with to-do headers uh, I put them down from Sunday through Tuesday then I used these little tiny page flags with a little bow on it which is so cute and I don't know if you can tell this has gold foil and it's so pretty it's all over the kit well most of the kit so with that little flag I put it to the side and then I wrote my work schedule and then I used this uh, pointed flag and wrote that it was payroll day then I used a full box checklist and wrote most of the things I had to do for work that day then I stuck down the big quote box that says sugar and spice and everything nice and I really like that font I think it's so pretty and so cute oh and then I forgot I had to write down the date and numbers but then I was like oops and then I wanted to use some washi tape to separate that that uh, checklist box and the quote box I don't know why I think it's because the colors are kind of similar so I wanted something to break it up that's why I put the washi tape on the bottom um, between them then I put a meal sticker on the bottom to write down my my dinners <clears throat> so on Tuesday I put down um, that washi tape and then stuck a page flag on top of that and wrote that was my day off and I wanted to use cursive. I don't, I don't think my cursive's that nice, but I don't know. I felt like this kit needed some cursive in it. <laughs> then I used a half box and wrote that I had to go to Social Security with my mom at 1 p.m. because we had an appointment. Then, um, because this kit doesn't come with any other headers, uh, but I thought the color kind of went well. The header color that was printed on the page, it kind of went well with most of the kits so I just left it on and then I stuck a planner sticker on there because I wanted to do a lot of um, 
editing for my previous plan with me video and I stuck down a page flag I mean a checklist flag and wrote things I had to do but I didn't do because we were stuck at social security for a while then I used one of the circle labels and put down a, a stationary heaven date night sticker and um, I hung out with the boyfriend and we rented The Conjuring. I love that movie by the way. I have it and I made him watch it and he was scared. <laughs> it was so cute. Anyway, then uh, we also started watching The Handmaid's Tale. It was pretty good. So yeah. Uh, yeah, that was it. Then on Tuesday, <laughs> Uh, I used the laundry sticker that came with the kit, and I wrote all the laundry in really bad cursive, but it's okay. You can't see it. <laughs> then I used a full box with the gold foil on it, which is so pretty. I love that box. So pretty. Then I used a must-do circle label and stuck it on top of a quarter box and wrote that we were at the DMV because my mom wanted- she had to- change her ID to the real ID thing um, and we went when I renewed my my license but there was some sort of issue they sent her a letter saying they had to go there so we were there and we waited for four freaking hours it was so annoying and then when we went we were finally there uh, when we finally got up to the person they were like oh no you have to go to the social security office oh my gosh I was so annoying I was so mad so mad that day so anyway, the rest of the day I just worked on my my video from last week. Anyway, babbled because DMV made me mad. <laughs> on uh, Wednesday, I stuck down that little tiny flag. Oh, after I did all the to-do headers and wrote my work schedule, I closed that day. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I like closing actually. Then I used a uh, full box checklist. And then moved it down because I wanted to use that do not forget, oh actually don't forget circle sticker on top of that. And wrote some stuff I had to do like ship my dad's invoices and help my mom correct her uh, note, that DMV notice. <clears throat> and then I, I guess I changed my alarm settings on my clock by accident. I think I was half asleep. So I had to do that too. Then I used a page flag with one of those bows. It's a bigger one. And uh, I wanted to work on my June bill planner. It's not really a planner. It's just a list of all the bills that are due. I just call it bill planner because it's easier to write. <laughs> then I stuck down another little page flag and wrote things I wanted to do for next week, but I didn't do because I was lazy. On Thursday, I stuck down another one of those little page flags and wrote my work schedule next to it. Then uh, I used a half box and <clears throat> wrote that I had to do store supplies and I had to do it for two weeks because I wasn't going to be there for uh, next week. <laughs> then I used a full box checklist and wrote things I had to do and didn't do actually. I was so lazy. I don't remember why. But do you really need to know why you're lazy? Well, sometimes. <laughs> I was just lazy. Then I stuck down that full box. There you go. Now you can see. And then I stuck the rest of the meal stickers on the bottom. I just think this kid is so pretty. I just, I just want to stare at it forever. Okay, maybe not forever because that would be crazy. So on Friday, uh, after I wrote, wrote down my work schedule for Saturday and Sunday, I put down two, the last two of the full boxes, and I wanted to use that weekend header, I mean banner, but it was so big, I didn't know where to put it. I tried to put it on the bottom, but it would cover things up, so I was like, forget it. And Saturday and Friday and Saturday are my busy days because of audit. <laughs> So, I didn't. I just decided not to use it. So, on a Friday, uh, I stuck down two of the full boxes, full box checklist. Well, tried to. I, I had to cut down the second one because it didn't fit. And then I used one of those page flags and wrote that was paid, payday that day. And then, um, 
wrote all the things I had to do in audit. And if I didn't write it down, I would forget because it's a lot of things. This is just most of the things. There's still more I have to do. But, yeah. And that's why my lists for Friday and Saturday are super long because I have a lot to do. It takes, it doesn't take long, maybe like 15 minutes at most for each thing. So, yeah. And I wanted to place an order for ingredients because I was kind of thinking that I wanted to reopen my eyeshadow shop, but uh, I didn't do it. Because <laughs> I feel like I need to plan some more if I really do. Anyway, so then I started planning the Saturday and where all the things I had to do. And I sucked out uh, another page flag on top of Friday and Saturday because uh, I wanted to write that there was a Planner Boss Collective Sale or PBC Sale. And I'm showing off the rest of the pages that were left over. And this is what it looks like. I did most of the stuff. The only thing I didn't do is call T-Mobile to change my bill. Oops. I'll do that next week. Next week's my vacation, so it might be more interesting. I said might. I don't know, really. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Okay, bye.